left hand, the left hand only has four different patterns to do, and then they, they repeat, you know, after that. So we're just going to learn those four, and I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, <clears throat> for left hand. We start with an F octave. Here's middle C. Come below that to this F. Put your thumb on it. Then an F below that on the pinky. And then I have the fifth in the middle, the C, octave and the fifth. Alright, so that's what we do there. Moving up to an A flat octave. A flat is the middle black key in a group of three blacks here. So on this A flat with my thumb, A flat below that with my pinky. E flat, here's E flat, in the middle of that. So all black keys here. Now I'm going to move down to an E flat octave. But don't be afraid of playing on black keys. You get used to it. Uh, e flat octave. Here's E flat right here, this black key on the right side of the two blacks. Put your thumb on that. E flat octave below that with my pinky, and then pointer on B flat. Right here is B flat, so play that octave. And then I'm going to move everything down one black key for the D flat octave right here. D flat on the thumb, D flat on the pinky, and A flat in the middle. All right, so left left hand from the beginning. Next box up to A flat octave. Next box down to E flat octave. Next box down to D flat octave. Okay, now let's try right hand from the beginning. Starting on a B flat below middle C. Here's middle C, here's B flat below that. Then I want to have a middle C and an A flat together. Then another C up to F. Then I'm going to have a middle C with an E flat. Here's E flat for the right hand together. Then a D flat. D flat's this key. And then a C, middle C. Below that, a B flat. Here's B flat. Here's a G that we want below that, so that's right there, and then another B flat, back up to the middle C, and then down to an A flat, and an F below that together. Okay, so the from the beginning here we have okay, and that's that here and here. tells us to go back. Repeat. Here. My asterisk. Come over here and finish what we haven't done yet. Middle C with the right hand, then an E flat above that, and then I'm going to play that E flat again with an E flat octave on my left hand, and then come down to a B flat here on, on my right. So right here. Okay? So just remember that a flat, this little lowercase b sign, when it comes right after a letter, it means to play the black key to the left, immediately to the left. So if this is a B, B flat is this key. If we want to do D flat, here's D. D flat would be this key. So that's what a flat means. Uh, I'll finish this in part two, so have some fun with that.